Hello everybody, my name is Bohmir, I'm a pianist and today we will continue our tour at uh, the manufacture of Steingraber and Zöne in Bayreuth. And in today's video I will show you different lengths of the piano and uh, you, will, you will hear the differences. I mean, it's quite a huge difference, so let's go for it. We will start in this beautiful room with plenty of even more beautiful pianos, different, different sizes, different lengths. We will start here with the biggest one. It's Steingraber uh, Model E and it has 272 centimeters. Very nice piano. This is the same, just different model. And then, uh, yeah, we will try those, but I don't know where to place the mics. So I think we will go then for that one. It's very easy to put mics there. So I'm just showing you the beautiful pianos. Wow. They are made really good. I mean, they are really expensive. They are extremely expensive. And uh, it looks like that they are made in the old style. They don't use aliquots, controlled aliquots like Steinway, Yamaha and all of the other brands. This is like 100 years old model. Cool. But it works. It's, it's just fantastic. It sounds great. So now I will try this beautiful Steingraber 272 Model E and let's hear how sounds the biggest piano from the line. Now I will show you the second piano, it's Steingraber Model C, 212 centimeters, and uh, I have the microphones in exactly the same position as with the longer one. Uh, the gain in the recorder is exactly the same, so let's compare those two pianos now. So this is Steingraber Model C, 212 centimeters and let's hear how it sounds.
So now let's see the third piano. The third piano is Steingraber model, I don't know what, 170 centimeters long. It's quite dark here and also it's a problem that the piano stays uh, just next to the wall. So maybe the sound will be a little bit worse than usual, but uh, I think you will hear the difference in the sound. So let's try it. So Steingraber and Zana. Model A, 170 meters long, it's the shortest model they do, and let's hear the difference. So you heard it, uh, I don't know if you hear it in your headphones or in your speakers, but uh, this one was completely different. Also for me as for a pianist, uh, this piano wasn't so inspirative, uh, the sustain was shorter and especially when it comes from upstairs from those really long and nice concert grand pianos 272, 212 to this 170, it's completely different league. I mean. For me, this is like hobbyist piano. I know that it's really expensive piano. I mean, it's great piano, but in comparison to those concert grants, I mean, it's completely different. And also the action isn't so, so fast. It's a little bit harder. It's completely different from uh, the actions above. It's yeah, in, very interesting also for me as for a pianist to just try piano and compare them. So I hope you heard the differences and that's it for today. Please let me know to the comment section below what you think about those differences if you heard it. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Have a great time.